understand the process of fertilization in flowering plants, let us first see all the floral parts. Thalamus or receptacle provides the attachment place for the different floral whorls. Sepals make the outermost whorl. They protect the flower during the bud stage. Petals are generally brightly colored to attract insects for pollination. Anther and filament make the male reproductive part of the flower known as stamen. Stigma, style and ovary make the female reproductive part called the pistil. In the ovary are ovules. In an ovule is an embryo sac and in the embryo sac is an egg. During pollination, the pollen grain comes to lie on the stigma. The pollen grain has two layers. The outer layer is known as exine and it is made up of a substance called sporopollenin. The inner layer is thin and is known as intine. At some places, exine is thin. These areas are known as germ pores through which will immerse the pollen tube. Pollen grain has two cells. The smaller cell is known as generative cell which will divide to form two male gametes. The larger cell is known as the tube cell which will give rise to the pollen tube. The embryo sac has three cells towards chalyza. These cells are known as antipodals. There are two nuclei in the middle called the polar nuclei. Three cells are towards the micropyle. The middle larger cell is known as the egg. Two smaller cells are called the synergids. The egg and the two synergids would form the egg apparatus. The pollen tube emerges from the germ pore. The haploid generative cell divides to form two male gametes. The pollen tube enters the embryo sac through the micropyle. It enters through the degenerating synergid or between the egg and the synergid. The first male gamete fuses with the egg to form a diploid zygote. This process is known as fertilization. The second male gamete fuses with two polar nuclei to form a triploid endosperm nucleus which will change into endosperm cell. The fusion of three nuclei is known as triple fusion. Endosperm will divide later on to form nutritive tissue which will provide nourishment to the developing embryo. The process of fertilization and triple fusion together is called double fertilization.